One day, some of you will be running your own businesses. You'll be entrepreneurs. Some of you may already have started. And when you start a new business venture, you'll be faced with one big question. What does it cost to run a business? Previously, we learned from the law of supply that if the price of a product increases, the quantity supplied will increase too. And if the price of a product decreases, then the quantity supplied will decrease too. Price plays an important role in the decision of a firm to supply more or less to the market. And the question that business owners have to answer is, why will a firm only supply more of a product if the price of that product increases? The answer will explain what motivates most entrepreneurs, why we have a stock exchange, and will also shine more light on why the supply curve is upward sloping. And in order to understand that, we must first understand how the cost of production influences the decision of the firm to supply goods and services. Let's start by asking why a firm wants to supply goods and services in the first place. As Adam Smith observed, firms supply goods and services to the economy out of their own self-interest. It's not charity. But what exactly is this self-interest? Well, there are a number of different goals a business might have. Maybe to be the largest firm in the industry, to make the best product, or have the highest sales. What we will assume is that firms not only want to make a profit, but that they wish to maximise their profits. And they will constantly try to find a level of production which results in maximum profit. From this, we can assume then that firms will only be willing to increase the production of that something if it means more profit. So, when does a firm maximise profits? Well, if profit is the difference between its sales of a product and what it costs to make it, then for a firm to maximise its profit, it must ensure that the difference between its total revenue, that's the sales price of the product times the quantity sold, and the total cost of producing that quantity is as large as possible.